Good morning all, shiny shove, and it's Friday. So the weekend is coming, not sure what you've got planned. But here's my question, here's my little nudge in the right direction for you. What or who is guiding you? So when you're actually setting yourself up for your day, when you're setting yourself up to have a good day, who or what leads you, guides you, actually starts to drop in what is it that you're going to do today what is it that you're going to going to experience today who will you be today who or what do you use as a guide who do you listen to who do you take direction from who influences where you're at how you're doing what you're doing what you're actually doing and i suppose my my real question is is how often do you let that be you and how often do you let that be something or someone else? And when I say something, that could well be your inner guidance. That could well be the way that things are, or it's how we've always done it in my family. So it could be the cultural element of how you, you know, the community in which you grow up in. And that's really what I'm asking you to take a step back for a moment and think about who or what is guiding me? Because... The moment you start to listen to that who or that what, that's actually then your life. That then becomes how you live out what you do because who we listen to and the guidance that we follow then creates the experiences that we have. So if you're not enjoying the experiences you're having, who or what is guiding you and what would you rather have if you don't like it? And if you do like it, how could you do more of it? Many blessings. Have a wonderful weekend. I will catch you on Monday.